What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you guys want some cheap MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter for the fastest and most reliable purchase on the internet right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we do have some new content coming tomorrow. We're gonna go over the market, we're gonna go over a bunch of cards. In this video, before we get into it, guys, 100 likes on the vid, smash that like button, drop the sub if you're new, man. We're very close to 12k. More likes we get, more subs we get, more MT giveaways on Instagram and Twitter. So, guys, please drop the like, drop the sub. We're getting closer and closer to 2k21. So you guys know what that means. The market is going to continue to drop like crazy. So we're going to go over some methods. We're going to go over pricing. We're going to go over cards. We're going to go over everything. So let's see what we can do, guys. Um, I actually ended up selling my whole collection for Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And yeah, I sold them. I sold my boy Rashad Lewis. I sold Shaq D's. I sold Weber. And I didn't get Kareem. Why, guys? Because their price is going to go down even more. It's simple, man. I promise you, man. I promise you they're going to go down in price big time. And we're going to show you why in this video. All right. So here we go, guys. There's a lot to talk about. We're going to start talking about it in this video. We're going to go over pricing. We're going to go over what I think is coming tomorrow and all that good stuff. So let's get into it, man. There's just so much going on in 2K right now. We got super packs. We got token packs. We got this. We got that. Let's just go over pricing. Let's see if there is a premature market crash because that does usually happen in this game. Um, honestly, no one really big did drop any market talk videos. So whenever, let's say DBG, HTB, or like YBC drops a market talk video, you're going to see the market prematurely crash. But since it is endgame, you're just going to see a consistent drop in the market consistently you're never gonna see the market go back up for probably years okay um right now man if i were you i say this in every single video sell your teams right now thank me later that's it if you don't sell your teams you're gonna be in a lot of trouble man i promise you just trust the process sell all of your cards buy them back tomorrow tomorrow could be something insane i'm thinking out of position i'm thinking a token market i'm thinking a lot of things i don't know what's coming guys all i can tell you man you're gonna see a market crash guys we got about a month a month and a week left a month and two days left month and two weeks left until nba 2k 20 so i don't know man token market players another thing i want to talk about they're up a lot not token market players token cards in the set to get tokens these cards are up a ton. My guy, Clay Thompson, was around 90k. He's up to 140 now. They're probably going to drop sooner or later once a ton of people try pulling them or getting them or whatever. They're most likely going to drop. If you really do want to get these token sets, they're going to they're gonna probably go up. If there is a token market update, they will go up. But I would say in about a week, they will lose their value. Same thing with Chris Webber. Same thing with all these cards in the sets that did rise. Like, for instance, man... Chris Weber, I sold him last night for 150,000 MT. I got him for 80K, okay? So it depends, man. You got to really just look at what's going on with the market, what they drop. So I'm going to give you some scenarios in this video as well to make you MT. Um, so let's say they drop a token market. They drop Goat Shack or whatever. They drop Goat Giannis in here, right? Pretty sick. They got to drop something tomorrow, probably token-wise, even if they don't. There's going to be an insane set. So let's just say they drop Opal Giannis in packs. He's the set reward, right? You're most likely going to see for token. I'm just going to go over to token market one first. For the token market one, they drop token market update, right? This Clay Thompson will probably go up to 200,000 MT. I'm almost guaranteeing this. These pink diamonds, they're kind of rare, man. Larry, uh, Larry Johnson was going for like 10 to 15K not too long ago. If you guys did invest in him, 29,000 MT. If you guys invested in any of these cards, I would honestly just recommend selling. Strickland's up a big time too. If you invested in any token cards, you're going to make a lot of MT. And honestly, they could go up even more. But honestly, while they're high right now, I would honestly recommend re recommending selling them. Um, I know Diamond Danny Granger in one of the sets. I don't know which set it is. Wherever that Diamond Danny Granger is, I don't know why. But he's so expensive, man. He is like... 
super super expensive for what reason i don't know but it just shows uh is it in one of these flashes there it is man this one for 100 tokens this danny granger is up to around 70,000 mt this trash diamond card that isn't even usable all these sets man are very valuable you just gotta pay attention to what goes up what goes down so in my case if you want to make mt when the token market update drops it's simple guys you just gotta pay attention to what they came out with and what cards are rare what cards aren't rare michael ray richardson isn't a card that's rare john wall isn't a card that's rare some of the diamonds some of the pink diamonds some of the opals like in this set the rare card is yao ming okay nick batum is also a rare card i don't understand how but it just is ricky rubio is somewhat rare for an amethyst and yeah yao ming man 140k luel dang isn't rare in this set clay thompson's the rare card larry johnson somewhat rare strickland went up ryan anderson went up all these cards are gonna go up not only that guys this set damian lillard went up so much mt from when he first dropped he was at 40,000 mt now he's up to around 70k mt guys this lillard if you guys invested a mil in this lillard you're gonna make double the profit probably around 1.7 mil you'll probably make 700k if you invested a mil so like i said i said it in other videos i said it in this video token market players are very key you just gotta pay attention to what's good what's not good this wiseman's up a ton as well man this wiseman was going for around 15k i think i sold some for 12 some for 15k he's up to 30,000 mt if you invested in a man if you invested a mil of them you're gonna make so much mt but there's just a lot to say a lot of stuff going on there's going to be a giant market crash in general even if there is no token market update if there's no target token market update buy clay no 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 buy clay thompson when he's a buyout if there's no talking mo token market update you're gonna see his price drop like crazy because everyone's like yo what the heck there's no talking about token market update i'm selling this car i'm selling that car i'm selling this card and they're gonna try to get their mt back up to go after the new packs that is one thing i'm gonna say that's another thing i wanted to say if there is no tar token market update i can't speak they're gonna rise up like crazy so that's another thing i want to talk about another thing i want to talk about there's no token market update those prices will go down if there's no token market update and they drop these new packs you will see a sick one of the biggest market crashes in 2k history you're gonna see shag down you're gonna see whatever down man some cards that i predict coming out go bill russell Giannis of some sort maybe a point guard out of position maybe a galaxy opal maybe a go maybe a go uh what do we got go go tim duncan um we could see a go t-mac we could see a go lebron and if those drop they're not gonna make them in the token market they're probably gonna make some really good token market players maybe a nice out of position i don't know we'll see though i don't think if they drop a go in the token market you know it's not gonna be something special it's probably gonna be like a six three point guard decent card i doubt maybe they drop kobe in there i don't know because they do like throwing out kobe for free even though tokens aren't even free right now token markets these do not pop these are a waste of them these are a waste of tokens man tokens are very valued right now i do have 1500 i should have more but i accidentally bought john Morant. don't really want to talk about that so overall man market is crash as it is you're gonna see some cards probably drop later in the day at nighttime man if you really don't think the market's gonna crash tomorrow you could go crazy at night and buy as many cards as you want it's completely up to you in my opinion man as you can see i have 2.5 mil i have a decent team i think this is my team right here this is pretty much my team or this is my team nope this is my team this is my team right here guys it's nothing special it's pretty much free other than Giannis. pretty much free man there's a lot going on right now i just hope you guys do take these tips get ready i would sell your cards like right this second just in case there is a market crash tomorrow and yeah just make your mt just continue to strive continue to be great Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Stay tuned for more content, guys. Have a good one. Peace.